of Antarctica. Back with the elephant seal. That was honestly my favorite stop so far. Hey everyone, today's video is a continuation of my previous video because I got so much footage, like always, that I had to split it up into two. So this is March 6th or day five of my Antarctica cruise. In my last video, which is the footage you see here, we went to Dansko Island and saw Gentoo penguins, which this is one of the hot spots for them. They were so cute. And now later on in the day, which is today's video, we will be going to Nico Harbor, which will be really exciting. And it's one of my favorite landings of my whole cruise, so I hope you enjoy. Hey everyone, all right, I'm back. It is 2.08, I just had lunch, and I had a short little lie down because I got a little tired, but we just got an announcement from the bridge that we are heading to Nico Island to hopefully land on the, actually land and walk around, and they were saying just now in the announcements that it would be a inter continental landing which means we would actually be on the continent of Antarctica because of course Antarctica is a island but there's like the big Antarctica and then we've been hitting all the like little islands up in the north along the peninsula so that's my understanding and again depends on the weather and she said if it doesn't work out today it will at some point on this trip we're still pretty early on in the trip but I wanted to do a little description again like I did earlier on my phone where they have written out like the fun things about where we're going. So Nico Harbor lies on the eastern shore of Andvard Bay, um, so south of where we were earlier in the Arira Channel. It was discovered by Gerlange during his Belgian Antarctic expedition in 1897 to 1899 and is named after a floating whale factory ship Nico which is often used on this bay. Nico operated between 1911 to 1912 and 1923 to 1924 in the South Shetland and Antarctica Peninsula. This site is a mainland landing and is approximately home to 150 breeding pairs of Gentoo penguins, so not as much as the other place we were at earlier today that had 1,600, but still a good amount. Um, and some of which these um, rest around the Argentinian refu refuge hut. Uh, Weddell seals may also be seen hauled out on the cobblestone beach or above the landing site. So that is the update. So sounds like we'll go out for sure on the boats, the Zodiacs, but weather dependent. Right now it's looking really calm um, for a landing, but that is the update and nothing else really new as of now, but it's been a very beautiful day the water is looking really glassy and calm which is really nice after the rain yesterday and that is my update for you all so i'll probably see you out on the zodiac at some point and yeah okay see you then bye Holding its little belly. What is it? Is it a rasio? No, it's not a rasio. It's, oh, it's, it's very, very happy. Is it a waddle? Oh, stretch. Big stretch. Oh, smile. Wake him up. Sorry, I'm about to sleep again.
I've officially gotten to the actual continent of Antarctica. There's the flag. Take a photo. There's penguins everywhere. Up there. So I can officially say I've been to Antarctica. This isn't an island, it's the actual continent itself. Okay, so there's a pathway and up there is a massive colony of penguins and a lion or a sea lion and apparently we're not allowed to stop and take photos because of avian flu and to, you know, not get too close because there's so many of them. And it's muddy. Ooh, okay. So I might just hold this and walk and try not to slip. This one's being so loud. The baby. I can't get over the massive amount of penguins there are. That's crazy. So cute. Okay. And that's the seal. <laughs> Do you see the elephant seal? Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at the amount of seagulls, not seagulls, penguins. Oh my gosh. Look at him. Oh, hi. Hello. Yeah, just follow the yellows. Okay, it's starting to really smell like penguin poop. So many penguins, so few people. Oh, I'm very close to them, look at that. I'm going on a penguin highway which actually is a thing that the penguins make because they walk so much. And then the ice is different colors because of ice algae. So pink and yellow. It's really cool natural phenomenon. Oh, we're gonna let this penguin pass. You can go first, buddy. Oh, that's so good. Oh, that was such a nice hop. Oh, I think he's getting on the highway. Okay, go do a little roundabout. They're blocking. I'm trying to think of the best without slipping. Oh. Traffic jam. Go, buddy, go. Dang, they're fighting. Huh? Yeah. Oh. I don't know if you can tell, but it's pink. Pink snow. From algae. We made it to the top of a unexpected hike and look at the amount of penguins. I don't even know. Hundreds. Look at that. 
and then the ship is over there and the water is so beautiful. I'm gonna go down now. Well, actually, we're gonna walk to that bit over there and then go back up and then go down. We just gotta time it right so we can get back on the Zodiac. Look at these guys. I just can't get over the amount of penguins and the water being glassy like and the pink ice. So, it's nice. This might be my favorite stop so far. We've only had like three or four, but still, it's really nice. Back with the elephant seal. He's so big. This one's so little. Baby. Oh, hi, little one. So little. Try not to hit you with my poles. Excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> Do you hear the ice falling? Dang, it's over there. Oh, the penguins are running away from the high tide from the glacier. I'll let them. That's crazy. It was completely still and the glacier fell in the water and caused all of this. We got to run up with the hiking poles. And all the penguins had to come up. Bye penguins! Right, we are back and I got so much content with the penguins that was honestly my favorite stop so far there was supposed to be only like half the breeding pairs as the one from this morning but it felt like so much more so we just got back and I'm gonna get undressed and kind of chill and have dinner and tonight is like an ice baker icebreaker trivia night but yeah so that is the update and yeah Talk to you later. Hey everyone. Okay, it is the end of day five actually. Now I'm trying to remember the days of the week then how many days I've been here. So it is day five and I just ended up having dinner. And then afterwards we went straight into doing, there's always like an evening activity on the ship around like nine-ish once dinner is done. And that went for like an hour and a half to like 10.30. And today it was like an icebreaker game night, getting to know other people on the ship. And the host, his name is Russ and he's really funny and it was just like a lot of fun and his energy is very like funny. He's pretty much like a comedian, this British guy. Um, but it was a lot of fun and now it is almost 11 and I want to get sleep um, and you know get ready for bed and do all of that. But yeah, so that is pretty much the end of the day. I really enjoyed my landings with like the Zodiac cruising and then landing on the different um, shores. And I think the second one that we did today was my favorite yet, honestly. It was a lot of fun um, because there's just so many penguins there and doing the little hike along with the penguins going along the penguin highway because that's what they're called when they walk so much and they create their own little pathways along the snow and they, those were the gen 2 penguins and they're the ones that are most commonly seen in this part of antarctica and they're the only penguins with like bright like beaks and um feet which is really cute so i think they're also my favorite they're 
really really cute and yeah tomorrow i think is looking really similar there sim seems to be a theme with our days now where we have lunch where we have breakfast till 8 30 and then there's a zodiac cruise and land weather permitting and then we have some time on the ship and lunch and then another zodiac cruise and land and then we have like the briefing and dinner and some kind of like evening event so that is the day and i know i got a lot of footage so i'm going to end it off here if you want to continue on my Ant watching my antarctica series i'm going to be doing that so stay tuned for day six which will be tomorrow bye